Sunday morning and everyone is feeling fantastic today. Daniel got four hours of sleep and then he got another three hours of sleep. So sleeping really well. I slept well, Steph slept pretty well, more than usual, which is pretty good. Now Steph is undergoing a big challenge. She has to get the baby into the car without any help. We know she can do it. She can do it just fine. She's very capable, but she needs to have the confidence in herself of having done it. So let's go check in on her. His mom got you all bundled up in there, buddy? Do this. Every instinct in my body is telling me like open doors for you, but I know I can't. I totally forgot my purse and my phone. What would you do? I would go back, but I'm not doing that. Why not? Where's your hat go, buddy? Oh, it's in the car seat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's beefy. That sounds like a great plan. Look at this cute little nugget we're putting in the car. Steph's been doing it all on her own because she is a master mom. 90% on her own. No, it's this pocket. The front? You put it in that pocket. Thank you. Reporting live here from Baby Central on Sunday night. It is about the Nuggets' second bedtime of the night. We're going to be heading upstairs very, very shortly. Daniel's actually been the best baby ever today. He slept last night, he played with us, he was smiling, he was feeding. He cried a few times, but he's a baby, that's okay. I am looking forward to this week. It is the week before Christmas, so we it's going to be a short week. And I think it's going to be very light on work. I don't think anybody's going to be working too hard. This has been, hands down, no questions asked, the best weekend with Daniel since he's been born. He got a bunch of sleep, we had friends over, we had party time, we had fun time, he slept well, he fed well. Everything seems to be going according to a better schedule than usual. I am delighted with everything that happened this weekend, and I couldn't wait for every day to be like this. This would be awesome if every day could be this good. I know it won't be, but I really do feel like things are trending in a positive way. And we've been super productive around their house. We've been reorganizing things. We've been assembling furniture. We've been moving furniture. And now I think as soon as we get the house settled down a little bit and we get like his crib set up, then we're going to be turning a little bit back over to the productivity side, uh, fa outward facing. So doing things for the world. So maybe putting a little bit more polish on the baby log app, maybe making it available for other people to use and then doing things like getting back into demos with Angular. So I'm feeling very excited, feeling very motivated, very positive, and I hope I can get a bunch of sleep tonight and do the same thing tomorrow. For the past week or so, I've been having trouble with Google Photos where all of my uploads have been failing, and I contacted Google One Support, wasn't able to figure out what was going on. I ended up switching from the dev channel over to the stable channel, and everything seems to be working. So I think Chrome has a couple fixes they need to do before Google Photos is fully compatible with the latest version. But the good news is I was able to get all my files uploaded and my synchronization folder is clear. So now I can get everything off my phone and not run out of disk space. Very glad that this was able to get this project done this weekend. The weekends are so nice because we get to spend time together, but Daddy's gotta get back to work this week. Don't worry, next weekend we'll take you on a really big adventure and we'll meet lots of new family members, okay? <laughs> Say good night, Daniel. Good night. Okay, that is not a face that wants to say good night. Good night. <laughs>